Took a ride to Holden Beach, North Carolina, in between Wilmington and Myrtle Beach. It is desolate. People are heeding mandatory evacuations and preparing for the worst of Hurricane Florence. West Brunswick High School, one of three shelters in Brunswick County, is filling up. It's, uh, it's in a low-lying area, it's a mobile home, and we have three dogs. Now, you can bring the dogs in, which is a good sign. Absolutely. And okay. they, they provide kennels, some kennels, if you don't have any. And um, they're sheltering them in a different spot, so they'll be safe as well as us. Now, requirements for dogs and cats, pretty easy. Bring their food, medicine, and proof of rabies shots. For the two-legged creatures, it's pretty similar. Make sure you have a photo ID, any medicines, and something to sleep on. Volunteers tell me the cots are used up already. Now, if you're riding out Florence like we are, hopefully you have all your provisions. Not much is open now. You could be there for three or four days without electricity. Check with your neighbors to see who else is staying. Also, take your compass app out and figure out which way the winds will be coming to protect yourself inside your house. Understand that hurricane winds go counterclockwise. Now, whether you're staying or leaving your house, take out your smartphone and videotape the interior of your house and different items to help insurance adjusters afterwards. Whatever you do, don't go out and be a hero and try to videotape during the hurricane. Wait for the aftermath. Here's how I did it safely during Matthew two years ago. Here's an early morning update on Hurricane Matthew from Sunset Beach, North Carolina. It is here, but the... Trust me, I've been out in my share of hurricanes over the years, and this is one you don't want to mess with. I will check in with various reports. Stay safe, everybody.